dear 12. 12.40 p.m. Jack and Dirk are in the garden. So Alan Shearer has the, scored the most goals of any premiership player, right? I think so, yeah. I think it's him. He just retired. I got to watch him a little bit. He, he was not as, but he was so smart. I suppose he'll be a coach, huh? He's, I think so, yeah. He should be. Some of the housemates are in the kitchen preparing a roast for lunch. That's not our dinner. It smells wicked. You want to taste it? What is it? Can I look at it? It's a potato. It's a potato. Can I try a piece? I don't know if it's cooked there. I'm just tasting if it's cooked. Has it got onion? Has it got mm. um, Has it got garlic in it? Very nice. I love Mmm. And that's without salt. He doesn't have salt. Mmm. What? Shilpa, what time do you think dinner is? I think we should serve it at 3 because everybody is going to be hungry by then. I don't think the chicken will be done by 3 o'clock. The what? The chicken? chicken? Of course it will be. If I put it in now, it's already marinated. How long does it take? Two hours. Two hours? Two hours? Two hours? Yeah. That's what I took. That's what I took the other night. Yeah. You've got two hours. That's standard. Didn't yeah. You? I'd cook mine for longer usually. Because <laughs> no wonder I keep getting the shit. <laughs> okay, I think we should put the chicken in now. Yeah, it's got to be for two, two hours. hours on. At least two hours. Put the oven on. Yeah. Red, and I'll take these things, things down a bit, I think. Because it goes on weight. It goes on how, how big the chicken is, yeah? Standard is two hours for a really? small to medium chicken, yeah. Many two things. hours. On a large chicken, two hours, 50 minutes, if to be precise. Really? I don't get yeah, I thought lamb took that long. No, no lamb takes no. longer. Lamb takes about four hours. Lamb if you cook it slow. One fourteen pm All the housemates are in the lounge. Big Brother has provided Danielle with instructions for today's task. Housemates, today's task will give housemates the opportunity to ask Big Brother questions that they have always wanted the answer to. Housemates are not allowed to ask about recent events in the outside world or anything that conflicts with the Big Brother rules. Those sort so of you things. can ask, like, can you cry underwater and things yeah. like that? Because that's the question that you might have always wondered. What come first, chicken or the eggs? So it was like that. So couldn't I say what colour underwear did I put on this morning? I could tell you the answer oh. to that, though. I mean... <laughs> what is the lifespan of a sperm whale? I don't know the answer to that. Of a sperm whale? What is that? Killer whale. Orca. Never you ever watch Free Willy? You don't know what a whale is? Yeah, you do. You know, you know what a, a shark is, don't you? Yeah. Whale. Yes. Yeah. A whale. What? <laughs> because you said it's your accent. Whale. Whale. A whale. It's the same. A whale. Wow. A whale. Well, I wouldn't sound right. Like a whale. Wow. A whale. How do you say to mate? What? Well. 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 Well, I don't know what question I'm going to ask, and I'm going to get called in one of the first, aren't I? She'll put and ask them how, how long to cook a chicken. There you go, then. <laughs> You're all right. <laughs> yeah, I want to tell you all something. Most of whatever I've cooked... That's why I've been shitting I've never and being cooked sick. Before. Because of what? Sorry, chewing and being sick. Why? Because she's cooked the chicken. She was going to cook a whole chicken today for 40 minutes. 45 minutes. 45 I minutes, the whole chicken. I was like, because normally hours. when you stir fry chicken, I thought chicken is the easiest meat to cook. I had an upset tummy after that. <laughs> you did? A few nights ago, I had an upset tummy as well. I did. We all had the shits. After your, after your curry. <laughs> Daniel. <laughs> One forty five PM Cleo, Ian, Jade, Joe and Jack are in the lounge. As part of today's task, each housemate is allowed to ask Big Brother one question they've always wanted to know the answer to. There is one question I really genuinely want to know the answer to. What? But I could have looked it up myself. What? what? I don't, if we say now, then they'll know it and they'll go and find it, won't they? The old... I don't know. I'm happy to tell you. The yeah, old... Just tell us. Nan and Grandad still have sex. 
Shilpa, Jermaine, Dirk and Danielle are in the kitchen. I don't think that's really going to take two hours to cook. That chicken is almost done. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. But, I don't but know why they would take turkey. two hours. Turkey uh, takes two uh, hours. Yeah. That chicken takes about 45 minutes to Yeah, 45. To an hour. That's exactly what I said. That's what I, I've known to for it to be at home. For 45 minutes to an hour. But if they want it for two hours, let them give it to them. Oh, yeah. Black is the boot. How long has it been in there? It's been in there for an hour now. It's done. <laughs> it might not be done all the way yeah, inside yeah, yeah. The way I used to tell if you move the leg, if the leg really Right, moves. right, right. If the leg is exactly this part. If that what? comes off e e easily, that is still tough. Mm -hmm. It's been there how long, Daniel? It's only been in there for an hour now. Okay. But is it not, is it too high? What's it I on? I don't know. It's on 200. Mm. Now that's about right. These potatoes are very mushy. Mm -hmm. I think I'm making a mess, but it's okay. Right, I need to sit down and think of a question. No, see, I thought the whole the whole conversation with the uh, with the with the whale was going to start it start some tension because the way you yeah. like laughed at it. Because see really she was saying wow. She wow. Was. Why didn't anybody take up for me? I I, you guys. I said I, I said well. Yeah, that's what you well, that's what it's called. Did you Wait understand it's from why? Why I didn't wow. I didn't oh wow. See wow a while is you're waiting a while. Exactly. But there No, it was not wild. It was wow. Wow. Two twenty p.m. Jade, Joe, and Danielle are in the lounge. I need to think of a question. What are you asking? Why are some people born with a higher IQ than others? I got the highest IQ out of all the footballers' girlfriends. That surprises me, because you you are you are a bit empty out there in here anyway. You've become a bit empty in there. Some of the housemates are in the kitchen. By the time the, the roast potatoes are done, this so is going to go cold. Tell the girls. Why do you want me to? No, Daniel's put the roast potatoes. <coughs> Let me just have <laughs> No, 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 no. Let it be in there. I'm getting rushed now on my potatoes and I don't like it. It's only early anyway. I'm not really... I don't know I if I'm going to... I don't know if I'm, I'm going to trust mine that yet. chicken. It's not been on long enough. I want to eat it, but I'm scared to, because why, why I feel do, like a bit of protein. Why, why say it's going to be done for four and then do it for fucking half one, two o'clock? How long was potatoes going to take? I told Philip they're going to take an hour from when I put them in. Yeah, that's right. The chicken should have took two hours, and we did say on the second hour, tell us and we'll put the potatoes in. Okay. So it would have all been done together, but apparently the chicken was done. Because I think everything's done now and it's all going to spoil. Yeah, but... Well, that's Shilpa's fault, because... No, 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 no. Just, but oh, that's, that's just the situation, and you know, it doesn't matter whose fault it is. But is that chicken done properly, yeah? It looks it, and it, look, and it looks... Mm -hmm. It's gonna taste like shit. What is? It's chicken. Well, what, are we waiting for the potatoes? Yeah. Oh. You get it's ill on a chicken, you are fucking ill. Because you can get ill on a chicken. Um, that's gonna be about an hour, isn't it? See, what's the time now? The fucking, I'm fucking pissed off. I want to fucking bite We did say, I, 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 am, I am a witness, to be fair. Two hours to do. When the first hour's over, let us know and we'll put the potatoes See, in. Now I can't even. Fuck, now I'm the one that's the fucking wrong one because the potatoes aren't ready. And the potatoes were put at the bottom <laughs> of the shelf. It needs to be at the top shelf. She's annoying. Fucking bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I think the potatoes are ready. Were they? Yeah, because they're much darker than what they were. See, they're they're really roasted. Are they? Are they right? Yeah, they're all mixed colors. Sorry. Keep opening the door, and they have to stay in there longer. Keep the door closed, otherwise the potatoes have to stay in there longer. Now the chickens come back. That mm. chicken's been in and out more times than you could imagine. Put the chicken in. Because they know the chicken the ain't cooked. 
Can you shut the door? She'll provide my potatoes won't get done, girl. <sighs> She's not listening on purpose. <clears throat> She's doing all that thing on purpose, I think. Hmm. Cheers. <laughs> Two forty-six p.m. Most of the housemates are at the dining table. So, I mean, do you want me to carve the legs up? Is it done? Just to, to it's done, right? I don't. Know. It's done, right? Um, I think so. I don't know. Actually, Shall we put it in for a little? I think we need to put it in a tiny bit more. I think. I don't know. Jay, will you just have a look? Is it done? Just see. There. Right. Knew it would be done. No, oh, red. this is nice. Yeah. There's red near it. Right, nice. Legs are really tricky, yeah. yeah. It, it, you know, once the legs yeah, are yeah, open, it'll cook. I'll that a minute and I'll show you. Yeah, look, you see? Yeah, look, there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, right. it there. Yeah, should we put it in back again? Oh, well, yeah, chicken's really, really funny. Do you know that she'll put really. No, I know, I know, I know. Just. You know, if it does, it's, it'll be it'll be within five minutes or so. If it does. It's pink. Oh, nice. Is it pink? Yeah. Yeah. pink. You're kidding. Oh, well, we did so. Okay, guys. Sorry, you'll have to wait for like an Five hour. More. Is yeah. it very pink? No, we can start. Need the legs and then we'll just, we'll just... Like when you cut the leg and yeah. at the bottom. Yeah. 2.54 p.m. It's been eight minutes since Shilpa put the chicken back into the oven. Joel, you want to take a look? Jade? Yeah, yeah, that leg looks all right. I don't know, the other one. Yeah, that leg, was the other, did you cut the other leg as well? OK, guys, this is ruined dinner. Because the broccoli is all burnt now. No, it's oh, perfect. Not it's good that way. Oh. Let me dive in and see if it's cooked. If it's not, we can whack it back in. Just check that leg. Sure it's cooked. Yeah, that meat's brown now, and that's white. Yeah, that's good. OK, somebody's plate. Somebody's plate. Plate, 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 plate. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Thank you. Oh, the broccoli is fantastic. It's nearly like Cajun. Looks absolutely fantastic, Shilpa. Well done, Shilpa. Could I have the other leg if nobody wants it? Oh, Or we'll share it. Oh, but you know, there's a lot of chicken on there. Somebody share it with me. Yeah, I, I would. OK. Give me a piece of it. There's still more, there's still more meat there. And Joe? your dad's a 34. Chicken? I've had some, thank you. Yeah. See the blood there? Mm -hmm. What? There's oh, oh, and just cut it open and the blood. I mean, you're going to be so good. That's the bottom. Yeah, it's good. It's cooked. The only thing I'm passionate about. I've just cut it. When I cut into it, there was blood come out. And you can't see it now. No. no. Well, yeah, just yeah, when I cut it open, yeah. It's all, it's all good. Look. See? You've got to be careful. You have to be really careful with chicken. 3.38pm. Jack has been called to the diary room as part of today's task. Jack, what is the one question you have always wanted to know the answer to? Um... Why have I got nipples? And why do other men have nipples? What's the point of them? Every other part of my body is a use. Like my fingers, I need to pick up things, my eyes to see. But then the nipples, what? I don't milk, milk babies with them. So what do I need them for? Chilpa is in the bedroom. Joe and Danielle are in the lounge. Um, what I'm going to ask, what makes... Why are some people like that? Shall I ask what makes the world go round? Mm. Yeah. Shilpa should go in there and ask how long you should cook a chicken for. <laughs> <laughs> I said maybe they cook them differently in India. Might do, might no. They probably fucking... Cock if That's I why they're all thin, because they're sick all the time. Because <laughs> they're real. <laughs> <laughs> the ill off Shilpa's cooking. The thing that aggravates me with Shilpa is she fingers your food off your plate. <laughs> what was it? She was just picking onions. Yeah, she went, she, she went, she went. She went. And she's just done it to Ian as well. She went, oh, this chicken is fine. And like, on his plate, he started eating his chicken off of his plate. That grates me. Is that, do they do that in India, eat with the hands? Or is that in China? 
Simmons, yeah, isn't it? I'm not sure. I don't like all that, though. Put Gee, I don't know where their things have been. Yeah. 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 Yeah
And when they die, where do they go? Because they can't get buried under gra under the under the grass like we do under the earth. So where do they go? It's a whole new world, the Eskimo world. It really is. I know nothing about it, and I really want to know about this Eskimo world because. I don't, for start, I don't even know, I thought that the Eskimos lived in Antarctica, but Jack said that that's, um, that's, uh, not a place, that's just loads of water. Um, so, where do they live? Will they ever be extinct? Could you maybe get me a book on Eskimos? <laughs> Five forty PM Shilpa is in the bedroom. Cleo, Joe, Danielle and Jack are in the kitchen. That's really pissed me off. She's sunken in bed. She's all by herself looking through the window. Is she um is she sulking? I don't think everyone should get paranoid. I don't, you know, I think some of people are just tired and... To be honest, I don't really give a fuck. If I'm being honest. Well, I don't think there's anything that much to, to care about, really. You know what I mean? I don't think there's a... I think you imagine there's a bigger problem than there is. There is no problem. I'm not bothered because I know that we haven't done that wrong and we're not singling her out whatsoever. We were just trying to help her by saying that the chicken needs cooking for two, two, two hours. Well, we've got a nice chicken stock going on, so that's the next stage of that. I wouldn't be eating no chicken soup. That's uh, definitely not be wrapped What's around me. With you? I won't be eating any chicken what soup. You? Suddenly. I want to go and sit in the lounge. All right, not if you pop them. You pop it in. I will pop in. I might have a cup, another, another cup of tea, lovey. Oh, another one. Yeah, I might. Are you okay? You're troubled, aren't you? <sighs> Thank you. I didn't mean that badly, but uh, you seem uh, mentally dishevelled. I'm not quite running smoothly. You feel uncomfortable about things. Well, I mean, it's like every time something goes wrong, like, like Shilpa, like, I get the ump and wants to, like, everyone to feel sorry for no, her. No, I don't think that's the case. Why did you go and talk with her? Because I'm, fe I'm fed up of fucking just... saying... No, but she isn't, she isn't wanting that. I mean, she isn't feeling sorry for herself or anything. I know, but it's just... It's just we're all living in a small space, isn't it, really? Yeah, that's what it is, really. Jade, Jermaine and Joe are in the lounge. Do you want to marry Jack, Jade? Yeah. I'd love to, yeah. Yeah? yeah. I, I find that he's my companion, not just my, not just my partner, my companion. Like, you know, like, like, without sounding too deep no, and stupid, here, like my soulmate, well. yeah, like, we can go out and have a holiday together, just us two, and just have so much fun. Yeah. We've been through so much rubbish in the papers. Well, as good, do you, know, do you know what I mean? And he, yeah. he's not in anything for himself. And he's so. And to find somebody that takes you on with two children yeah. and to treat them as if they're their own, yeah. but without stepping on their dad's toes, it's really difficult. So, yeah, I'm very happy. Good. No, he's, he's, he's a very good guy. Very nice guy. I could never have a big wedding. I'd be so embarrassed. So embarrassed. I guess weird, weird things embarrass me. Like, I can yeah. get on stage in front of thousands of people, not a problem. Walk down an aisle... Cos that's why no. it's all on you. Sorry. Yeah. Well, uh, now I've met uh, Jermaine Jackson, I know I won't be uh, struggling for someone to sing at my wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Chilpa and Ian are in the bedroom. I'm just concerned because there's clearly a divide everywhere. There are divisions in the group, and it's just, oh, I don't like it. Don't worry, it's OK. I know, but it just, it affects, you know, other people in the group. Well, oh. that doesn't affect you. I know, but, you know... You be your own person. It's not affecting me, trust me. It's not. Don't worry about me, really. The well, equal number of people on my side. They're really, no, they're really friendly f to me, and you know, and oh, that's great because that's okay. you know they've done nothing to me, and I've done nothing to them. <clears throat> what are you really upset about?
because I don't like conflict and I don't like being in the middle of it. There is no conflict from my end, trust me. And there's no, no conflict even from their end. They just don't maybe find me as much fun and that's okay. I can't be... I can't be what? I can't be them. No, no. They can't be me. That's okay. We all make our choices, right, in the outside world, who we mm -hmm. want to mingle with and whom we don't want to. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So, it would hurt me if maybe you you went drifted apart like that or Jermaine drifted apart. That would hurt me. Mm -hmm. This doesn't, because we never really formed a bond in the first place. It's okay. So don't worry. I'm chilled up. <gasps> I'm cool. Trust me. Six forty PM. Some of the housemates are in the bedroom. It's time. Is that, are those your lucky weeks? No, they're my depressed weeks. <laughs> so you're a depressed angel? Are you a butterfly or an angel? You're a butterfly. No. Bad I'm girl. A butterfly with the soul Bad of a girl. bull. <laughs> yeah. like Tinkerbell. Danielle, Jade, Joe, and Jack are in the lounge. Mm, she puts got little wings. She wrote him with every saying them. She got my nerve. Yeah, she puts them on when she feels down. She, uh, she just, she does reason. this whole feeling sorry for herself routine. Whenever she said, whenever she feels down or depressed, she puts on her wings to feel better. Oh my God. Each of their own. Cleo, very sweet. Mm -hmm. Very sweet. Yeah. She thinks there's a divide. In the house? Mm hmm Ian thinks that too. Thinks what? There's a divide. What, between us and them? No, and I... Between I, me I, and them. There's a clear and, divide. Look how they're smiling. And look at Dan Daniela. She, she's all around the bottle. <laughs> Problem is, they're all going to pile in here at 10 o'clock. No, tell them that they got to go to bed if they're You're the only one to let it get You should tell them because the only one you don't want to let nobody back answers you. Nobody says no, anything back to you and nobody wanna... will. I know, I understand. They'll listen to you. No, the no, place. she's the last person that can say, are you crazy? They will Thank you. listen to her. You, she can't say anything. Are you kidding? They would go nuts. Are you? What is wrong with you, No, Jermaine? she has enough problems. They, will... they haven't done I'm anything trying... to you. <laughs> no. You, they, they respect you. They'll, they would do it. Jermaine! Be quiet. That's oh. true. If I do it, it won't work. Of course it will, Dirk. No, 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 they'll, no. They'll, they'll, no, no. They got, no. It will work, because they respect Dirk. No. I like getting nominated, so... We can't talk about that, but I don't want to be too nice. <laughs> Seven fifty-eight p.m. Big Brother has provided housemates with a table tennis table as entertainment for the evening. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't do that. <laughs> I'm so cross. I think he is my companion is Shilpa. What? I think he's replaced Jackie with Shilpa. <laughs> My mum would be fuming. She'd be chucking things at the telly. Can I shut them doors? <laughs> That you didn't do that. <laughs> no, you're more and more, isn't it? <laughs> no, it is, Dad. Yeah, but then you're well, I'd I'd grouping the city, off yeah. and all that. I'd rather sit here in peace and quiet. Do you know what I find odd? Is that, and I don't know if, uh, if I'm being bad or if I'm just being over exurbent, but I just find that when she's down, she's very, very down. And will not talk to anybody, will not do nothing. But then, and I don't know whether it's true or whether it isn't. And then when she's having fun, I don't know whether that's true or whether that isn't. No, it's not. It's all a big fun. I, I don't you know. I, know I, I, I just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> You're not playing badminton for crying out loud. This is difficult. Eight twenty-one p.m. 
Jermaine is in the kitchen. Shilpa and Dirk are playing table tennis. Oh, you want to play a game? Yeah. Okay. Darsa, you start. Okay. She, I'm so what? bad. No, you're not. One nothing. Danielle, Jack, Cleo, Joe, and Jade are in the lounge. Okay. Fast, go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Seven, nine, right. ten, eleven, twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Eight, eight, nine, eight. Twenty. We like to drink with Danielle, because Danielle is our mate, 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 mate. That's good. I like this game. Can I lose again? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Ian is in the diary room talking to Big Brother. I'm just a little disappointed in Danielle, really. Because um, she said some really nasty things to Shilpa and just expects Shilpa to forget them when clearly she can't. And and I just think that she's been influenced by Jade a little bit. And, you know, Jade's a lovely girl as well, but I really think that Jade's not playing fair to Shilpa either. Jade should know better, really. I know she's, you know, the things that she says, she says directly to Shilpa. But from what I've witnessed in the house, she shouldn't really be saying them at all. Daniel is a completely different person since Jade came in the house. I don't know whether Danielle is impressed by Jade or she feels that she needs to impress her. I don't know, but she's clearly very influenced by her, definitely. Let's all put our pennies on the table and take a private jet to Monte Carlo where we can bag a millionaire. And dry up our thrush. <laughs> I picky to flick it. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I always elevate it. I tried to elevate it to another level. And then we saved it all up and put it in Shilpa's curry. <laughs> you know, there's a, a lot of name calling and just um, petty things, you know, just like not, not like sitting by somebody on a sofa or, you know, whispering in ears and, you know, it's clearly school ground, school ground behaviour. And I feel really bad for Shilpa, I really do. It's almost like bullying, you know. I was bullied at school, and that's what it feels like. Really, really unfair. I think, you know, Jade is very outspoken, and she's a strong girl, and everything she says, she believes. You know, she's from a completely different world to Shilpa. Um, so in Jade's eyes, she's doing nothing wrong whatsoever. But to onlookers, especially myself, I really think that she's... You know, she should watch what she says and think a little before she speaks, really. Every time I try and say something to stay neutral, um, uh, they just bite my head off and, and start slagging Shilpa off, and I just won't be part of it anymore. So the best thing for me to do is just extract myself from the situation and I'll be friendly with the girls and I'll be friendly with Shilpa and I'm just going to stay neutral and be happy, to be honest with you, because that's what I need to do to get my head around this whole situation. Where do you want it? Oh. Where do you want it? Over there? Over there? Oh, <laughs> um, they're going to see if they can get a new bat. <laughs> I'll be there now, two seconds. Ten or three p.m. Some of the housemates are in the lounge. Jack is in the kitchen. <clears throat> For today's task, Big Brother has asked each housemate to come up with one question they've always wanted to know the answer to. Jade is in the diary room. Jade. Eskimo is a term used to refer to the people who inhabit the circumpolar region excluding Scandinavia and most of Russia. 
Their clothing and shelter meet the needs of the environment in which they live, ensuring that they do not fall foul of the freezing temperatures. In answer to your question, Jade, by adapting to the environment in which they live, Eskimos are able to avoid the fate of becoming human ice cubes. Sami long words in there. I still don't understand how, but thank you. Because of their clothing and human environment, but they live in like an igloo, which is ice. If any Eskimos are watching Big Brother, I'd really like it if you just maybe wanted to meet me, just to give me 10 minutes of your time so I could just ask some questions about Eskimos. Jermaine and Shilpa are in the bedroom talking about relationships. See, my life has been like, we started so young and I've traveled. But your wife is what? I, I mean, travel. You're, you're compatible, you're, you're got along. We had like a dream. Wedding. We get along to this day. We got married at 19. We, we started dating at 14. And we didn't Jeez. kiss for two years or touch each other for two years because we were like shy and all that stuff. We had this wedding at. She was black. Of course. Oh, okay. She, we had this wedding at the Beverly Hills Hotel, and Smokey Robinson sang at our wedding. He sang a song for us, and the whole hotel was dressed up and all this stuff. And I was, was 19, right? And it was right in the middle of the Jackson 5 mania with all that stuff going, going on there. Then we stayed married for 14 years. 14 years? Yeah, that's, that's pretty good, huh? Yeah. Jack is the next housemate called to the diary room. Hello. Hello, Jack. Earlier today, you asked, why have men got nipples? Yeah. After conception, a developing embryo follows a female template. What? It's only after six to eight weeks that the effect of the male chromosome begins. What the fuck? Is that it? Can you not say it in normal words? So are you saying that we are girls before we're boys? Everyone's a girl. Prior to developing all the male characteristics you have today, you were once a female. What, so I can get milk out my nipples? Your embryo was only female for the first six to eight weeks. What's an embryo? Can it's time for me to ask you some questions? <laughs> sure, ask me. So you, um, of course you're not married yet. No, I've been in a couple of relationships, but the first one that I fell in love with um, my first serious relationship How was with an you? actor. I was 22 and a half. We fell in love in the movie sets and uh, he wanted to get married and I didn't. So that's why you broke up? No. Oh. Yeah. He, d he did? That's why we broke up, yeah. Dirk will marry you tomorrow. <laughs> Not my kind. Please. I know. No, but he's, he's a nice guy. He though. is he's, a very he's, nice he's guy. He's a great person. You're 31, right? I don't care. You'll be okay. Why are you depressing me? I'm not depressing you. You're supposed you. to make me feel better. Listen, you're a very successful person, and you're going to carry yourself that way, and you're going to go higher and higher and higher. So you got to find someone who's... I... I'm not going to find someone. I'm waiting for someone to find me. This is Big Brother with Cleo coming to the diary room. Oh, clenchy buttocks. I'm really nervous about this one because it's my fantasy. Hello, Big Brother. Cleo, you asked, is Clint Eastwood the son of Stan Laurel. Yes. He was born at St. Mary's Hospital in San Francisco to Clint Eastwood Sr. 
a Margaret Ruth runner. Stan Laurel is not the father of Clint Eastwood. Oh, no. Oh, big brother. I'm devastated. Eleven sixteen PM. Most of the housemates are in the bedroom. Ian, Cleo, Shilpa and Jid are in the kitchen talking about today's lunch. We cooked the chicken today for two hours. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just telling you how much time I cooked the chicken because we cooked it exactly for two hours, 15 minutes. You, you carry the other day, I enjoy it and I said that to you. I said to you, I said I was sick after, I said, but that wasn't because of you, that was because of me. I said, your curry was very nice. You don't need to sort of go away and get upset about it. You don't need to do that. Everybody... It wasn't that. It wasn't oh. you. If you were in my place and if Joe said that about the chicken. What did she say? But it weren't only Joe. I said it. No. Joe said it. But it was pink. It was all done. Can you speak to me? I'll speak to her and I'm fine. Joe was the first to speak up when you were feeling at your lowest when Carol walked out that door. Joe was the first to walk in from that toilet and say to Danielle and myself, I don't like bullies and I don't like people being felt as if they're, oh, what was the word? Let me get the isolated. word. Isolated. I've never had any doubts about Danielle or Joe. I feel every day there's there's an alternate story that comes out and there's there's a clash, there's maybe also because I come from a completely different country. So I can't be what you all are, I can't be your friends. I'm just gonna go back, your guys will be together so you know. I just feel completely... I mean you don't really fit in. Really. I don't fit yeah. in. And I don't want to spoil your scene, so I just try to stay away because I don't want to be like a sore thumb. I don't, I don't, I wouldn't want you to feel... No, I, really I don't feel anything, really, I don't. I don't feel anything, I just... I just want this thing to get over with. See, I'm, I don't, I'm not really I'm not, as nice. As long as I'm here, I'll try my best. And that's it. I d I'll be honest with you, I do sometimes think to myself, I, I don't really know when you're genuine and when you're not. Now, this seems very genuine to me. Yeah, but I do look and I think, is she being fake? Is she being real? Is she really upset? Is she really happy? Some, you're, you know when people are quite hard to read? I find you hard to read. Like, I'm not having a ticket you saying, don't never cook again, do 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 I'm just saying that for your own benefit, I think you should take a step back. Yeah, I was only just going to do that. But not in a nasty way, I'm just no, saying, I as in, if anything, I'm being quite nice no, by I, saying I, I, that. I'll take it, I'll just, I'll make my own food, and I'm, I'm okay with that. I mean, I don't know why I was doing this. I must be really stupid. Cleo, Jade and Shilpa have been talking in the kitchen for 36 minutes. And today is the first time, I think in the last, what, five, six days that we've ever had a conversation. You're, you're hard to sort of think, yeah, she's genuinely upset. Like the Carol, I knew you was genuinely upset, that's why I've come over and said, oh, you're okay, and that's why when that all kicked up, I thought, what the hell? That I didn't take up for Carol is that when you thought that I, I was not being genuine. I think what shocked when, when you people me, was when Carol and um, Cleo come up on the screen, and you know I I, I couldn't I couldn't pick I just couldn't do that. You know I know Cleo and I just got to know Carol and I like them both and I couldn't choose. We you know you then piped up and said you know we've got to get it over with, yeah. and then you and then you choose and also more to the point not because of it was Carol and Cleo but because you was also involved. Yes, you didn't say whatever they had said, but you was there, so I thought that you would have just gone, I'm not going to be part of this. Whereas but I think Cleo would have gone, yeah, but you do. Because we did. We didn't do it. It was part of their choice. It's we each their own choice. Did. That was your choice to have done that. If we didn't, they would have still been. Right, exactly, exactly, but that would have been their choice, not yours. It was still our hands. It was, it was a hand down win, even if I did put Exactly, so you might have no difference anyway, but why did you do it? Because I was just pushed with it. Maybe I didn't think about it so much, eh? I didn't make the rule. I didn't say choose between Cleo and Carol. No, you didn't. But you did it. I you choose to do it, and I choose not to do it. Yeah. You choose which, which to do it, and Daniel which, choose not to do it. Which I think was fantastic. Maybe you could take that, you know, maybe you're willing to uh, 
take that risk. I didn't. I... Oh, I'm sorry, I think that disappointed a lot of people. What I think I know that disappointed a lot of people because we were shocked at your reaction. I can't speak to her, but I can't speak to her. Theo never made personal attacks. Theo never was aggressive. She didn't make fun of my toes. So I have my reasons. And if I'm fake... No, no. That, that's, what, that's when I then thought, oh my God, but that's when she's playing a game, she's fake, she's genuine. I have I've seen her all over Carol, I've seen her saying, you're this, you're great, I love you, do the little look. You know, within a matter of ten seconds, you're out shooting up there. I just thought no, that maybe you were sat on your hand and you thought, I am not choosing between these two people because I sit there every other night and tell them both that I love them. So I refuse to be part of this. I don't need to be part of this. So I refuse to be part of it. But you wanted to be part of it and you chose to be part of this it. Is and a that was a shock. And that was... Exactly, this is the game. You're playing the game. You're yeah. right. You're exactly. right. You're right. You're right. Exactly. You're right. You just, you just hit the nail on the head. It is a game and you're playing the game. You're right. I played the game by the rules. I'm not playing any mind games here. I'm just playing the game by the rules of the game. I'm not playing any mind games. <laughs> but, you know, everyone in here you is a really nice life. person. I we just need to... Yeah, I don't, it's going to be hours of being in the business. I've never had a single person say that I was not genuine. That for me is a shock. I'm sorry. Please no, 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 don't no, no, get no, no. I'll just be honest. Like, that's why I'm being That's why it's just, I'm just, because I, that's I'd love for you to say that to you and say that to somebody else. You know what? I'll never be fake because that's the known thing about Shippa You see, that's how I see. I know I laugh, people make fun of me. They say Dirk and they say, oh, and they laugh, and I'm scared to even laugh anymore because I feel you're just going to poke fun at me. Right. It's got to be difficult for you to yes. kind of come from all this, and, and yeah, we'll, I don't know how we can't. Yes, of course. What? <laughs> the thing is, you know, you're both really honest people, and it needed to be able to speak yeah, to one another. Yeah, you need to know that I'm not going to lie, I've never lied to you. Yeah, but you needed to, to speak, speak to each say, other like tonight. Can I see your party for like, two seconds before I was slagging you off? Nah, I wouldn't. So, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're not no way. I'm leaving here. I'm going to go get you. Tomorrow's another day. We should, we should, we should start. We should get to bed. Yeah. Good night. Good night, night Jude. a show. Shop is a show. The shy and retiring John McCrurick joins Russell for Celebrity Big Brother's Big Mouth starting now on E4. Next on Channel 4, a fight for life for Abby's baby in ER.